The former New Mexico senator already serving a year and a half in prison on corruption charges was handed down another year-long sentence today for stealing money from his campaign and lying about it. News 13's Rebecca Atkins was at today's emotional plea hearing. She is live at district court with what Phil Griego had to say to the judge. Rebecca. Well, Dean, Phil Griego appeared before our cameras for the first time in an orange jumpsuit. The once powerful lawmaker asked Judge Brett Loveless for mercy yet again in an entirely new case. All we ask is that we get that time to put our lives, our life together again. That was Phil Griego shortly after he pleaded guilty to two counts of perjury for lying about campaign finances. He also pleaded guilty to two counts of embezzlement for stealing money from his campaign. Prosecutors say Griego was spending campaign funds on himself and his family for things like paying for his son's car repairs. Griego is already serving 18 months in prison for steering the sale of a state-owned building through the roundhouse to make $50,000. Another year will be tacked onto that sentence. The attorney general's office says these types of crimes will not be tolerated. The lesson to be learned is obey the rules. And uh, Phil Griego has learned that lesson well. The office of the attorney general has uh, gone out of their way to make sure that they get multiple convictions against Mr. Griego, and they're going to continue to do what they can to root out corruption. Now, Griego's attorney and his wife both made Judge Loveless very clear that his son was put on life support while he was in prison and died, saying that's punishment enough for the crimes he's guilty of committing. Dean and Jess, back to you. All right, Rebecca, thank you. Griego also paid the remainder of his campaign finances to three nonprofits across the state. He's up for parole tomorrow for the sentence he is currently serving.